what would be the cost of entry for something like that? We're just talking about FDM or FFF, which is like the normal 3D printer that you'd see that is laying down the plastic filament and building it up in layers. The materials that you can use are going to be, in almost all applications, a thermoplastic. So the most basic material that everyone prints with is PLA. Great for prototyping some end use parts. It just depends what you're trying to do. If you step up to something like nylon, polyamide, that's a really good material for like in terms of a thermoplastic for abrasion resistance and toughness and stuff. Depending on what type of nylon you use, a pretty good thermal resistance as well. But the problem is then like a really entry level printer that might be 500 to a thousand dollars, it's not going to be able to get the nozzle temperature high enough consistently or reliably enough to print a material like that. And then if you have like a nylon with carbon fiber reinforcement in it. Carbon fiber in those filaments is really abrasive. So you need like a nozzle that's harder wearing. So that increases the price and things like that as well. So there's some good options out there under a thousand dollars. We have a Bamboo Lab X1E, US dollars. I think it's under three grand. Plenty of other options out there from that supplier or other suppliers.